Hello, it's Theo from Theo's Tech Tips, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to run old Manifest version 2 Chrome extensions in 2024. Let's get started. So you might be wondering what old Manifest version 2 extensions are. So you might have seen this old pop-up in Chrome before, and it means that in a few months or so, these extensions are just going to stop working because they've not been updated for the new versions of Chrome Manifest. But some of these extensions are quite hard to migrate. For example, uBlock Origin is an extension that is very difficult to migrate due to some of the Chrome policy changes with Manifest version 3. So we need to find a way to run these extensions after Chrome kills them. So this tutorial is mainly going to be focused on macOS, but if you have Windows or Linux, you can follow similar steps, and I can link the official Chrome documentation in the description. So the first thing you want to do is to close Chrome, and you want to fully quit it instead of just closing all the windows. And we want to open up a text editor, and we're gonna make a new file, and we're gonna call it Google Policies mobile config so here we have a mobile config file and mobile config files are basically files that tell mac os how to manage certain policies and applications so the first thing you want to do is to copy the code in the description and you want to paste it into the editor and this is basically a starting profile that includes all of the basic chrome settings that tell it that it's a managed profile so once we've done that the next step that we have to do is to actually tell it to let us use manifest version 2 extensions so the way this works is that Chrome discontinued Manifest version 2 for us, but they've added a special enterprise policy so that organizations that still rely on these old extensions can still keep using them. So to enable this policy, we need to go inside of this dictionary object, and we're going to type key slash key, and we're going to type extension manifest v2 availability and we're going to make a new line and we're going to type integer like this and we're going to set it to two and this is because this setting can have multiple values one just does nothing and it will disable the ability to run manifest version 2 extensions past their deadline and three lets you run extensions but only the ones that your administrator installs for you two is the one that we want because it lets you run all the extensions, no matter if you installed it or your administrator installed it. So once you're done, we're just gonna save it and we're gonna close out of our code editor. So now we want to go to Spotlight Search and we wanna type Profiles and we want to click on this plus button and we want to find our profile. And this is just telling us the details of our profile. We can just click Continue, we're gonna click on Install and we need to enter our administrator password. And now it's done. So now we need to close system settings and we need to open up Chrome and we need to type Chrome colon slash slash policy. And if everything went well, you should see this policy here. And if you don't see the policy, you probably mistyped it. And if it worked, you should see status OK. So now we can test and see if it worked by going to the extensions page. And you shouldn't see this warning anymore. So now, even when Chrome deprecates those extensions, you'll still be able to run them. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. I'm Theo from Theo's Tech Tips, and I'll see you next time. Bye!